hello there, everybody, and welcome back to more Alexa's Ultra Modded Isaac. Today, we have played as many, many modded characters in the Ultra Modded Isaac. Characters like the Depressed Zack, the Hollow, Deleted Sodom, and Gamora. But today, we ask ourselves the age old question of what could happen if you could play as a mother frickin' car in the Binding of Isaac Repentance. This is Car, he's unstoppable. Let's hop in. Let's hop in immediately, and let's frickin' send it. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah. Okay. Um, realistically, though, it's a car. <laughs> it's a car. Um, we, we drive around in our little, uh, little Lambo that we got here. Our, our Eurovision Lambo. Um, and we can crash right into rooms. Now, the only issue is if we crash into... A wall that is not able to be passed through we die other than that I think we're invincible <laughs> I, I haven't really I haven't played a bunch so yeah I mean like a, a bomb rock does nothing right it does nothing I don't even really have to go for the enemies if we don't want to we also so we can slow down and break a little bit um, otherwise he's kind of full speed ahead, but, um, we don't really have to go for enemies. We, we can just, we can just speed run this son of a gun, because, I'm gonna be honest with you, you can't pick up items, e anyway, so, like, there's no reason to really even go for, um, your item room in any way, shape, and form. Almost crashed into the wall and died there. I mean, I'll, I'll show you, we'll go to the item room. Is the damn Zodiac, you can't pick it up. Cause, Cause you're a freaking car. Um, you think a car can hold the Zodiac? I don't think so. Oh dude, this is just life is a highway. I'm gonna drive it all night long. As long as we uh, figure out how to properly move, I may have to to actually kill enemies in this room. I don't know, I probably I probably can just crash right through the wall to, to make it to where I need to go. Send me. Baby Plum. D uh, it's an insta kill? Okay, um, so like, hear me out though, right? Hear me out. What if, what if I can go, okay, keys, keys don't matter. <laughs> keys don't matter, they said, because it's all the same. Okay, we can go down. <laughs> what, where, where were you when Alexa tried to beat Mother as a car? Where, where were you, huh? An answer me this riddle me the the question we we have one heart right but like i'm just gonna level with you who the hell cares right oops i'm in the boss fight oops is wormwood um oh dude tight wheelies tight wheelies you love to see it um do i even care about the devil deal i got a flat tire and then i freaking died okay you know what you got me i don't know how the heck i got a flat tire but that's that's definitely news to me. Uh, dude, I busted a hole through the middle of this room. What the hell? Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Just just give me give me through, dude. Give me through. Send me on my way, dude. Do 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 do. Take me to my boss fight. Maybe maybe um where were you when Tyler didn't go for mother? Um and maybe where were you when Tyler just tried to win a run? Um, as a freaking car. Oh, we already busted through the secret room. Oh, yeah, we busted. We busted just the way I, I like to bust. <laughs> Phrasing, possibly, but also maybe not. Oh, let's just keep it going, dude. Let's just keep it going. I'm feeling good about a potential boss room up here. Uh, it's a freaking triple kill. Send me. And then take me right into the, the heart of the beast himself, Mr. Pin. Are you freaking kidding me? A uh, pin, pin appears to be uh, relatively indestructible today uh, because I think. Oh, never mind. We're good. We're good. Um, I'm not gonna go into devil deals. I think devil deals are a little bit of a fool's gambit. Uh, it gave me a flat tire last time. Am I gonna go into an angel deal? That's a question for sure. Should I go into the planetarium? I mean. There's no reason not to, J just to get the sweet tunes, right? Oh baby, flat tire, friction up for a while. You fell to your death, yup, you dead doo-doo. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I don't I don't necessarily know what that means. Okay, so no let's just like let's just not go to a planetarium in the future. Let let's I'm I'm now kinda oh this is actually I gotta be a, a solid driver here. You didn't know that I was actually a NASCAR pro. But I have competed in several NASCAR I was about to say missions. That's probably not the right word. It makes it sound a lot more exciting than what it actually is. It's just a couple guys driving in cars. And women. I'd say guys is a gender neutral term here. Um, not sure if the women compete at the same time as the guys though. But it, look. We're, we're being pedantic about NASCAR here. I, I'm just going to... I'm going to be the one to say it. And I know that this is going to make like two singular people mad. But like does anybody actually care about NASCAR? I feel like it's one of those sports. It's kind of like when you, you turn on uh, ESPN, the Ocho, and bowling is on. It's like you'll sit and watch it because there's nothing else on. But, like, you don't really look forward to NASCAR. I know there's some people that do, though, but I don't. If you're somebody that looks forward to NASCAR, I would love to know more about your NASCARian instincts. Which, which is another word for I would love to know how you got into uh, Car Goes Fast. I have a flat tire, by the way, so my friction has increased. I don't fully understand what that means, but I'm, I'm here. Oh, God, it's actually, like, freaking impossible to control. So, so that's good. Not, nothing like an impossible car to control. I feel like th this is how I drive. Oh, we destroyed some chests. This is how I drive in my dreams, dude. You, like, you know how you have the dreams where your car is just moving out of control? It's also the dreams where you're, like, running away from someone. And, uh, you're, like, moving in slow motion because your your dream can't really discern the difference between real-life muscle function and, like, dream world. Oh, I got a flat tire. Friction up for a while. I think it's when I destroy... Well, I got another one. <laughs> So far, I got about three flat tires. Make that four flat tires. You'd think that would probably make me slow down in the end. Oh, I turned my brakes on. I mean, it's kind of easy to control this sucker when you use your brakes, but I'm, I'm going to not. Okay, send me. Oops, you're dead. Oops, a daisy. Uh, dare I? Dare I come in? I mean, he got a little, he got a little crazy. That's for sure. He, he got a little crazy. We're really lucky that didn't send me uh, off a cliff like the um, planetarium did. It makes me wonder how many weird secret things like that are hidden in this uh, righteous little disaster. But that's for us to possibly find out at a later date. For right now, I'm, I'm gunning for the impossible. I'm gunning for that number one Victor Mom Royale. Yeah, mom, we about to get down. Where were you when he did boss rush? Oh, never mind. I ain't gonna do boss rush, dude. Oh, I got like 800,000 flat tires. Oh, dude, we're, we're like doing... Oh, God, the car is... Every time I hit a rock... Oh, dude, are you seeing the movement on this sucker? Oh, it like goes backwards every once in a while. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, can't do boss rush. Can't do boss rush. Gonna, gonna just go down. Number one victory royale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gonna go down. Go down to the next floor. Okay. This is, uh... This is something. I, in all seriousness, though, uh, incredible mod by JSG. Um, I'll have it linked in the description down below. Uh, he released this for April Fools, at least, I think. That's why he released this. Um, but, like, this is a masterpiece of, of Isaac modding potential. I have never seen anything even remotely close uh to this in my life uh it's actually like crazy impressive and i, I give you massive props my friend uh for creating such a abomination uh that is also like the funniest thing i've ever seen in my life get fricked loki get fricked loki times two uh you know what get fricked angel statue I'll kill every damn angel I see. 
Oh no, he didn't spin the ultra modded Isaac wheel. Who cares? We're a car. Okay, I couldn't even do like half of the things in the the wheel. Plus, let's be real, we're just gonna roll, uh, destroy every angel statue anyway, so that's what I'm doing. Take me out of here. Go to every curse room. Um, what the hell? We can play the blood donation machine. I don't like that. It's a small room, dude. It's a small room. Small rooms are... I, I saw my life flash before my eyes right there. I feel like the small room's a, a really high chance to just get our ass kicked. Somehow that dude evaded death. Oh, dude. We're, we're, we're so, like, kind of close to escaping the, the hell that we have put ourselves into. Like, we're on the womb. And you start with the Polaroid and negative. So we, we can get out of here, dude. Like, we, we can legitimately get out of here. We, we The car almost moves too fast. My pathfinding... Oh, God. Turn around. My pathfinding has to be, like, on point for this. Okay. Hello, mother. Almost. You almost had me. Um, I went down to the dark room. Dude, I'm going to tell you right now. I really wanted to do Hush. Oh, we have Curse of the Lost. That is horrifying curse of the lost is horrifying i i need to be able to freaking see if i can't see how the heck am i pathfinding man there's gonna be a mimic door at some point and i'm gonna lose my mind we are playing on the ultra modded mod pack i know that it it may be like tyler why why bother plus the mod also has a big warning that says turn off all other mods <laughs> So what am I doing? Playing with one of the largest mod packs out there? Okay. Feels good. We're, we're just... We're looking for no crashes. No crashes. Happy days. Hello, Satan. I'm just gonna chill in the middle. I'm just gonna chill in the middle. It's not... He can't hit me. I'm a car. <laughs> I insta-kill you. I'm a car. This seems like a brilliant position to be in. Oops, you're dead. It's the chest take me down you know what man sometimes in life you'd rather be uh you'd rather be good than be a car i fell to my death yep you're dead doo doo are you freaking kidding me <laughs> are you freaking kidding me okay um fair enough fair enough you gotta finish in the chest you gotta finish in the chest that's something that the phrasing on that one could definitely be taken out of context please i'm not i'm not talking about that take take me we're just gonna restart it was a great run it was a great run a lot of really good upgrades solid items that trinket we had was insane am i right kids okay we continue we continue i mean look there ain't much to say right i could do the whole spiel of like hey hope you had a good day Hope your car doesn't malfunction. You start driving in the Binding of Isaac. But is there really much? <laughs> Just get in the freaking hole, you little dummy. Just get in the freaking hole. There ain't much to say. Making some uh, cauliflower tikka masala tonight for dinner, though. Pretty, pretty pogged up about that, to be honest with you. There is no... I Where, where Anna and I went to college there was we lived basically above an indian restaurant so we got like homemade good indian food like once a week right um was that good for our health and or our wallets no it was not uh but that's beside the point isaac pays the bills <laughs> i'm really kidding on that one um so we we got you know a love for indian food and then when we move back to where we are now, there is a total of like one Indian restaurant near us. And it has like god awful reviews. They're like, they, their tikka is basically just like pasta sauce that they heat it up. Um, you know, it's, it's just, it's just bad. It's just bad. So now we just make Indian food. Um, but it never, like, come on, it's not gonna taste like authentic good indian food like what we had then so it's it's big sad um i've i've been craving like delicious indian food for a really long time um 
since... I mean, look, we, we make good food. I'm not knocking our cooking. I'm a heck of a chef when it comes to getting some... Uh, nope. When it comes to getting some uh, some good food made in the kitchen. But um, alas, you know what, dude? Sometimes there's, there's other stuff in Indian food that I just don't have. There's so many freaking weird spices that are not common in... Dude, what the hell does the beast fight look like? You know what? You, you've... Please? Am I not allowed to go down into this? You've piqued my attention. <laughs> Am I about to kill Dogma? Are we about to have the damn uh, car from the second Harry Potter movie at the end of this? Like, what, what the hell is this going to look like when we get to the damn beast? I have no idea, but that's something that I am I am extraordinarily looking forward to. This is just going to crash the game. I, I, I can sense this one a mile away. I got a flat tire. I'm on a flat type, baby. I was born this way. All right. I've gotten dad's note. <laughs> Send me into the ascent. Let's do all these floors in reverse and, and see what happens. Okay. Life is good. But anyway, there, there's so many spices that are just not common in normal uh, American cooking. It's like I we were at the grocery store. This recipe that we're doing tonight for this uh, cauliflower tikka masala calls for fenugreek leaves. And uh, I'm going to tell you, grocery store that we went to, man, you got no fenugreek leaves. I don't even know what the hell a fenugreek leaf is. So, like, the recipe is going to still be fine because I... If you leave out, like, one spice, there's no way that it completely changes the recipe to where it's no longer, like, edible. But it still kind of sucks to not not have some, some fenugreek leaves. It's not the first time either. It's like, it, it just sucks that as a society, we... At least in the U.S., I'm, I'm gonna say it, okay? We kind of make bland food. That's a Mimic door. Freaking hell, dude. I don't know what happens if I drive into the Mimic door, and I'm gonna be real, I ain't finding out. So, you you can you can just frick off with that. I, I am not here to find out. Send me up, please. We, we send me, okay, I'll, I'll take my time, please. Thank you, send me up. Oh my God, dude. The car just faces the the exact wrong direction as soon as you get in. Making my life real damn difficult. Alright, take me down to the paradise city where the grass is green and dogma is pretty. Alright, can't bomb the carpet today. <laughs> Some big sad. These halls are a little, uh, they're a little spicy. What happens when the, when the car goes to bed? It, it legitimately... Oh, freaking hell, dude. Okay. You got me. <laughs> you got me. Dude, I want to know. I need to know. It's not even It's not even a want to know. It's a, it's a damn need to know. What happens when you do the beast fight? Does the car fly? Do we get a damn DeLorean? The DeLorean doesn't fly. But I, I need to know. I need to know. It's not a want any longer. It's a desire. Anyway, tell me your favorite seasoning in the comments down below. I feel like as as a garbage can American, my my choice of favorite seasoning is so bad. Because my favorite seasoning is probably like paprika is my favorite seasoning. We put paprika on a lot, but it's because I was raised by a family where we have some Hungarian background and paprika is super big over there. Hence various paprikashes and things like that crazy how the word paprikash more or less just stands for paprika and then also like sh shut up <laughs> everybody knows that's what that paprikash stands for paprika sh now that honestly you want to hit me with a good restaurant idea paprika sh and it's basically you, you can see the logo already right because it's like Paprika, and then on the left side of the, the word paprika is a little, like, container of paprika. 
you know, a little shaker. And then it's the sh, but it's all in italics. And there's, it's like capital S, four lowercase s's, and then an exclamation point. And then the, the whole slogan for the restaurant is that you're going to shut the hell up when you eat our food. Uh, cause it's going to be so tasty. You're not going to have time to speak. Paprika sh coming to malls near you. And it's going to sell like eight different paprikashes. What, what are all the versions of paprikash going to be? I got no idea that look, I'm, I make the marketing. You guys make the, make the money happen. I also think that we're going this way, but it's really difficult. Never mind, we're not going this way. It's really difficult for me to comprehend where the hell I'm going. Definitely can't go in the planetarium or else we just freaking die. Um, since it jumps me off a damn cliff. I, I do guess we can go through. I got a flat tire, baby. We, uh... Flat tire is gone. We we can go directly through doors, and then that counts for uh, uh that counts for for doing this. But I don't know, dude. Okay, are we, we're we're already back to the damn ascent. Take take me in. Take me in. I'm going down. We'll do the damn old ascent again. You think I can't handle it? I'm invincible. You son of a gun, I'm a car. Alright. Are you freaking kidding me? Those pillars kill you? Send me one more time. <laughs> send send me one one more one final time. I need I need to experience the sweet gift of the beast in my fingertips. Fingertips is a weird place to have the beast, but it's like he's gnawing on your nails. You wanna you wanna feel uncomfortable all of a sudden? Uh, imagine putting a toothpick under your toenail and then kicking a wall. Ooh, you didn't like that, did ya? Send a couple of uh, shivers down your spine. Made you feel a uh, a tad bit uncomfortable. <laughs> Gonna cry. You're trash, Brock. Okay, please go. Please go get it. Get into my car. <laughs> get into my creepy white van. Yeah, that's definitely gonna go over well with the new neighbors. We're pretty sure. I don't know if I've complained about my neighbors at all uh, in videos, but the people that lived above us for a little bit um, were just insanely loud, and and we think they bought. They they have a kid for sure, um, and we think they bought the kid a like one of those cars that you can drive around. You know, like one of those, like, I don't know if they're, it used to be Tonka back in the day, but I don't, I don't think this is a Tonka car. It's like a, a big rig, but it's like for kids to drive around. And you know what I'm talking about. Well, we're pretty sure that this kid drives this car around like in the apartment and then just like crashes into walls repeatedly. Cause all day long, we just hear like, vroom, vroom, and then a big crash. <laughs> and, uh, it's been like almost two and a half months since we've heard it so we think they moved out and then we celebrated but then the other day it was like really loud again so we don't know if somebody else moved in but honestly as long as they don't have the car that's that's all that i care about in fact i, I think what happens is i stole their car like i think i think i got their car right here and it it going vroom vroom you son of a gun all right Take me all the way to the boss. Oh, I felt so good about this padding. You could do some pretty sick speed runs with this. I, I'm sure there's already uh, a speed running community. This has already been been submitted to. Uh, I don't know what the hell is the speed running site, man. How long the beat is not exactly a speed running site. But God, do I use that site way too often? Cause like, oh, that game looks interesting. Maybe I should make a series of it. Uh, and then I I go on how long the beat, and it's like, uh. First playthrough, 89 hours. And I'm like, okay, gonna cross that one off of the list. And then I look at the, you know, 100% completion and they're like, uh, might take you eight years. And I'm like, okay, well, in YouTube time, that means that I'll probably finish it sometime around when I die. Uh, so probably, probably not the, the best game for the channel, I would say. Okay. Watch, I've, no.
I was gonna say watch out for the freaking pillars, man. Okay, so take me one more time. I, I was I was yapping my damn mouth, and I forgot we were in the scariest part of the game. I shouldn't have even paid attention. I was doing so well when I wasn't paying attention. I don't know how I escaped that ever living hell the first time through, but apparently, oh dude, he's 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 taking some he's taking some psychopath hour paths. What the hell is he doing? Oh, we have to go through a damn small room. Uh, no, thank you. No, thank you. Okay, we're fine. What, you you were scared? I wasn't scared. I'm in a damn car. Whatever. Dude, speaking of cars, right? I'm I'm all in on removing all traffic lights in existence and replacing them with roundabouts. I saw something the other day that apparently like replacing a traffic light with a roundabout makes the efficiency of the traffic go up by like 190 percent or it's just, or it's even worse and it's like 190 times better than before i can't remember it, 190 something it might have been 190 times better which is like way more than 190 percent better 190 percent better is 1.9 times better which is freaking nothing compared to 190 percent better even 1.9 times is like that's respectable I improving traffic by one point oh no 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 we're safe oh no frick dude i gotta go back through oh we're life is a highway uh, no. <laughs> freaking hell man you know i saw i saw him swerving i saw him swerving and i knew it was the end but i refused to believe I got, I got full on blue pilled, man. Red pilled, blue pilled. I haven't watched The Matrix in like ten years. Ten years? I saw it my sophomore year of high school. It has not been ten years. It's close though. It is damn close. Okay. Keep, keep me, uh, keep me going. Oh yeah. Uh, probably just like stepping on spikes with a car is not going to improve your tire capability too, too much believe it or not um i have never gotten a flat tire in my life um you you may find it difficult to believe but i have not uh, i did have a faulty tire that would leak air every so often but he was not a flat tire i never got you know stuck on on the side i don't know why i said stuck like i was a a porn star or something i never got stuck Never got stuck on the side of the road, ever. Um, never ran out of gas in the middle of the highway. Never had to hitchhike my way down the highway to collect the uh, fuel at the nearest... Uh... It was a freaking mimic door. It was a freaking mimic door. You got me. There's something oddly peaceful about this. But, but gosh darn, if I don't want to get a, a dang win. Like, all I want is a win. And the problem is, I'm not even going to get a damn win, because I, I guarantee, as soon as we, uh, as soon as we make it to Beast, I'm going to die. Like, I'm literally going to die, because they're going to say that I fell off the damn earth, and I'm going to, I'm going to lose. So, I'm, I'm going to keep on, keep on trying, baby. Um, he just outie. What? My dude just gone. Okay. Well, you know what? This is a good time to just do, like, uh, one of these. How about we go to uh, 5A? Nope. How about we go to 6A? Just sneak into a little 6A action. Slide on into here. A and Lambo's back, baby. Lambo's back. All right. All right. No freaking pillars this is gonna be torture no freaking pillars We're, whatever you do no freaking pillars okay there's pillars in this room we hate them nope turn turn that crap around turn it or there's those aren't pillars those aren't pillars those are just those are just rocks those are just rocks those are pillars we're in are you freaking kidding me okay i'm i'm going right i'm going right back 
I, I, I can't, I can't do it any longer. I need to know, and then I'll, I'll maybe do a run to the chest so that we can say that we successfully got a, a victory. Because let's be just completely honest with you. There is close to, and I say close because uh, money can change everything. There is close to an 100% chance that I will uninstall this mod as soon as I am done recording this video. And then I will never play this character ever again in my life. Um, so do with that information as you will. But please allow me to just live a happy and healthy life. Thank you. We're moving. No chance of running into rocks that are too tall. We, we're just we're just living in a brand new Lamborghini based lifestyle. Also, thank you. I'm well aware it's not a Lambo. There's gonna be at least one person. It's like Tyler, you freaking idiot. It's not a Lamborghini. I almost crashed right into the wall. That would have been bad. That would have been bad. Okay. Are we up? We ain't up. Hey, baby, what you doing? You up? Hey, baby, age, sex, location. You got kick. ASL, ASL. You know what ASL means to me? American Sign Language. Get your horny heads out of the gutter chat. I guess age, sex, location is not exactly uh, a horny thing to say. Unless you answer it as like, <laughs> uh, 18, yes, your mom's bedroom. <laughs> then in, in that situation, I suppose, uh, age, sex, location, maybe, maybe a little bit deemed inappropriate. Okay, keep, keep me, keep me happy. Keep me happy, keep me going. We are in the basement. We are in your mama's basement. Guess what? Now we in, um, now we in your mama's house. Okay, very scary. Very scary. These hallways are very small. Okay. Be so careful coming out of here. Okay. We're good. He's dead. He's already dead. We destroyed the TV. He's dead. What the heck happens when cars fly? What happens? Tell me. I need to know. Oh, frick. <laughs> Everything, everything's sicko mode till there's a car flying in hell. <laughs> oh, this is... I chalk this down to one of the strangest things I've ever done in Isaac, man. Like, what, what the heck is this all about? You'd think that just the car alone was one of the weirdest things I've done, but here we are. Um, he just managed to break my holy mantle? What? How the hell did that work? I actually took damage. Hello, beast. You just gonna insta-die here in a second? <laughs> oh, yes you are. Yes you are, you son of a gun. Get roasted and toasted. I'm a damn car. Okay. Well, technically, I mean, we didn't win because I cheated, but it's just a weird character. It's just a weird character. A lot to unpack from from car, um, especially unstoppable. Uh, that that gets me too. This was a pleasure. Thanks so much for watching. As always, liking the video, much appreciated. I'll see you guys for some normal uh, modded Isaac Chaos in the next episode. Thanks so much. Bye bye.